to make a drawing as realistic as possible that's mainly all about light, where the light's coming from, how it reflects off the picture and shadows. So just working the graphite from dark to light. Sometimes you're not even drawing shapes, you're just blending. C6 complete quadriplegic. My injury happened away on the Bucks weekend. I dove off a retainer wall and it was shallow water. What I missed after the accident was not being the outdoors person that I used to be. Very active, always outdoors doing something. had a lot of guilt for all the family members and all the pain it caused them. Yeah, I sort of lost the person who I was. I didn't know who I was anymore because I couldn't do the things I used to do. So my first drawing was for my wife and she suggested to me that I just draw a rose for her, and yeah, so I gave it a go. Yeah, I guess it was Alicia's reaction that probably got me to keep drawing. So in the beginning it was just drawing to fill in days, basically, to keep the mind occupied. It wasn't easy, but it sort of didn't look the best, but it definitely gave me a good sense of accomplishment. I had to learn how to hold a pencil again and I'd learn different strokes, different tools to use. As it progressed, people started to like the drawings and then they wanted to buy them. What I love about drawing is people's reaction mainly when they receive a piece and it does make you feel good about yourself. <laughs> 